Hello guys, how you doing? This is your friend Alex and today I'm going to show you how to move all your WhatsApp chat data from the Android device to an iPhone. One of the main reasons people are still using Android devices is because they don't want to lose their chat history on WhatsApp. They've been using WhatsApp for a lot of years and they have a lot of conversations that they don't want to lose. So if they buy an iPhone, they're not going to be able to transfer the chats until now. So today I'm going to show you how to do it for free because before you needed a pay software. By the way, I did a lot of videos reviewing different softwares that they work, all of them work, but now there is a way to do it for free. So I wanted to show you guys. I have a Samsung Galaxy J7 crown on my left and I have an iPhone 7 on my right. What I wanted to show you guys is the chats that I have here, okay? This is what we need to transfer. So all these chats, you need to see it on the iPhone to make sure that it's working, okay? I just have three chats with different, you know, pictures and videos different stuff, you know? Okay, so what do we need to do this transfer? Unfortunately, we cannot use the public version of WhatsApp because currently it's not working on all devices. So we're gonna have to download a beta version. You're gonna see the beta version we're gonna use today, which is 2.22.15.11, okay? And this is from July 5th, 2022. So you need to download this beta. How can you download it? You're gonna open your favorite browser. You're gonna look for WhatsApp Messenger 2.22.15.11 beta. And you should go to this website, which is called APK Mirror. Com. If you have the regular version of WhatsApp and you install a beta, you're going to keep the chats. So nothing is going to be deleted. So go ahead and install the beta. Other than that, you need to download Move to iOS. You can download it from the Play Store. Also, I want you to go to the Play Store and check for Google Data. And just in case, if you can download data transfer tools and data restore tools, some of them you cannot even update. You see, can install data restore tool. Okay and this one it's already installed okay those two make sure you have them this transfer works on android 5 and up and i have let me show you android 9 which is android pi so i have android pi i have the google data stuff i have whatsapp on the beta and i have moved to ios so i'm good today july 5th 2022 the latest ios is 15.5 on your iPhone, you need to have it factory reset. So if you've been using an iPhone for some reason and you have data, make sure you do a backup first and then reset it as a factory default settings like this. Okay, so let's start. Let's start here on the Android. So open, move to iOS. Also, you need to be connected to the same Wi-Fi network on both devices, okay? So move to iOS, we're gonna continue. Agree, find your code, continue. And it's asking me for a code. This code I'm gonna find here. Click on English, United States, set up manually, log in to your Wi-Fi. And again, it needs to be the same Wi-Fi that you log in on the Android. I'm just skipping the steps to arrive to this screen, the apps and data screen. This is what we need because we're gonna select move data from Android. So select here, move data from Android, and you're gonna put this code here, 192.407. Preparing, it says, waiting, and look at this beauty, guys. Now we have WhatsApp here. On the public version, you will not see this WhatsApp here, you will not see it. You might see it here as far as WhatsApp, but you will not see it here. So we're gonna select WhatsApp, and you can see move chats to iOS, transfer your chats and media history to your new iPhone. You will not be able to transfer later if you skip this step. So just click start, almost done, next. And now you can select contacts and files WhatsApp. Should I move the Google account? Mm, why not? That's it, and then we click continue. And this is gonna be fast because I only have 64 megabytes. I guess you will have gigs of data. Also guys, don't forget to clean up your WhatsApp before doing this, transfer complete. So this is what you want to see guys, transfer complete. Done here on the Android, we don't need nothing to do. If you open WhatsApp, it's gonna be disconnected and all your data is still here. Let's work on the iPhone, continue setting up iPhone. You do need to log in to your Apple ID. This one usually takes a lot of time. So this is normal guys. So let's put the password. Okay, so we pass this and we're gonna click other options. Don't upgrade. I don't like the two-step authentication. Agree, it may take a few minutes to set up your Apple ID. So make this your new iPhone, continue. Later, welcome to iPhone. All right, so we are here. Good. Immediately after doing this, what you need to do is you need to open the App Store, okay, and you're going to look for WhatsApp. Download WhatsApp, open it, 
and here you need to verify it okay i don't have the sim card on the android or the iphone i have it on another phone so i don't have to move it around i have it here so any code or any phone call i'm gonna get it on this phone all right but this is just my case you can have it on the android or on the iphone all right so let's put that number 325 1730 so now we're gonna verify this number done yes so they send me a code right here july 5th and the code is 562 680 and look at this guys move chats from android this is the screen that you want to see because this verifies that the move to ios is working tap start to move chat history to this iphone start permissions needed okay allow access to all photos moving chats from android chat history move to iphone next my name my picture here you're going to see the numbers but if i say okay then it's going to turn into names because we selected contacts that's why when you do the transfer select contacts okay and let me just confirm that we have the chats that i showed you before and they are working you know that one the second one is this with jlo and the third one is a lot of pictures and a lot of videos right okay so this transfer is being 100% successful, guys. Let me show you what kind of uh, version do we have here. Help. And this is the WhatsApp that we have on the iPhone. 222.13.74. We got everything transfer and it was successful. This is great, guys, because yesterday I tried with the beta from June 30 and it didn't work. And today I'm trying it with the beta from July 5th and it did work. And I just show you how. So if I can do it, guys, you can do it too. And also I'm using Android, what, 9? And I already use Android 5. And a lot of people are using Android 11, 12. So, I mean, these are old devices. So if you have new devices, Devices, it should work even better. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. That's the best way you can help me. And I'll see you on my next video. Take care. Bye. Also the WhatsApp and contacts. Now, I wanted to show you this, something that I forgot. Oh, almost done, huh? It says, please finish registering on your new phone. Let me go back gonna cancel this transfer because I want to show you something though oh look at this guy since we already start the transfer we already log out of whatsapp so I think we we mess up hold on so contacts whatsapp continue but you know I'm gonna cancel this because I think I mess it up I mess it up big time as an idiot